Welcome back guys. Today I have a Walmart grocery delivery. This was originally about $98, something like that, close to $100 for what I got here. However, I did not like one of the substitutions and I did not have a chance to reject it beforehand and I also had a problem with a product. I'm also going to be getting $15.24 back from Ibotta. So after my refund, this ended up being $76.30. So I've spent $136.27 this month so far. I'm planning to spend $300 on groceries. That's $75 per week. And then $100 on everything that isn't groceries like medicines and diapers and clothes and shoes and all those types of things that we need. And that brings my total remaining, including my $100 for everything that isn't food, to $263.73. I did get most of the things that I needed that were not grocery here, but there is a few things. This box of loves was a substitution. I ordered the Parents Choice Overnight Diapers in size 5. It was 66 diapers, I believe, for... $15 and some change. They didn't have that, so they substituted these loves. Love should be fine. We've been using love size 4 diapers at night, and most nights it is perfectly fine, so I'm pretty sure that with a size 5 it will be great. I got a refund on this corn. I did not want my corn shocked. I do not cook my corn like this. I cook my corn in the husk, and it no longer has a husk. So, yeah. They gave me a refund on my corn. I got one mango because my toddler likes mangoes. I picked up a thing of black forest jam. This will do, it's two eight ounce packages. So it will do sub sandwiches for us twice. That is not on the menu this week, but I went ahead and ordered it because it will last a while. The thin sliced hard salami is also for subs, but this will only do one because it's only seven ounces in one package. I got a bottle of sleeping pills. Those will last for quite a while. I got two boxes of Nauzine, and I might get another one when I do my next Walmart order, because, like I said, I did not get all the things I ordered. I ordered a Walmart, or a watermelon, and they did not have that, so I did not get that. I got this Pedigree High Protein Dog Food Pouch. It was free after rebate, so I'll give that away. And then I also got this Concentrated Mouthwash. I don't know how I feel about that, but it was also free after rebate. It says one bottle is up to 300 uses. This is also a substitution, and if they would have given me six packs of diapers, I wouldn't have had an issue with a substitution. However, they charged me $4.27 per pack of diapers, which is the normal price, and that made it $0.15 cents a diaper. So this was $13.68 for 93 diapers, and I ordered... 180 diapers for 24.48. So that would have made them 13 cents per diaper. I did not like the substitution, so they did refund me my money. And I have three packages of diapers. I need at least probably one more at least to have a month's worth of diapers. I also got this pack of loves. It had a two dollar rebate, so I went ahead and ordered that. These we'll probably use mostly for when we travel because they just seemed to work better when you're in the car for a really long time. This Baya energy drink from Starbucks was completely free after rebate, so I picked it up. This is the pineapple passion fruit. Then I got some stuffed puffs. These are the cookies and cream, and they had a dollar rebate. And last but least, but not least, I've been struggling to find corn oil, and they happened to have it, and I got it delivered so we can have street tacos on Tuesday. That's everything I got from Walmart this time for $76.30. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below to subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell notification to get notifications when I post new videos. And until next time, we'll be seeing you. Bye, guys!